folks, my name is Andy, Andy Collins. You may know me, of course, from the Panto at Ellsbury. I'm also a presenter on BBC Three Counties Radio, The Breakfast Show, and I'm also the eye candy of this piece. This is... Um, Bethany Foster. Um, I work for Live Our Stay While I, I run the health checks. She's the expert, I'm the eye candy. That's how it works. To be honest with you, I was like, there's no way I'm getting one of them. I'm not, I'm too, I'm not old enough yet to get one of them. Mm -hmm. But you, you start to, don't you? As a person, you think, oh, that, well, that feels a bit weird. Yeah. Or oh, that hurts. Or oh, that shouldn't be feeling like that. So you kind of like, you know yourself to get, to get yourself checked out. But you don't, you start to see the signs. There's gonna be many people watching this going, well, I'm not 70, I'm not 80, I'm not old. I'm only, I'm only 50 or 45 or whatever. Why, why should they get a health check? So it's really important because a lot of these things can actually be hidden. So stuff like blood pressure, you have no symptoms. You can just be walking around with high blood pressure and you have no idea. So it's really important to get yourself checked just, just in case you maybe are kind of reaching those levels. How often should you get yourself checked? So we, we do checks every five years, um, but after 40, you should get a call from your GP. And it is all about prevention, isn't it? Prevention is the key. If, yeah. you, if you see it way before it happens, you can, you can change direction, change your lifestyle change what you eat, change what you do, and, that, and then steer yourself away from what could be a disaster. Yeah, exactly. It's all about preventive approach.